Welcome to my video. This is Ecogen. I'll be going over the equipment and talents you need to be using to best optimize the Iron Claw spec. I'll start with the talents and skill points. The talent PVE build is Fist of Iron, Ruthless Hunger, Pursuer, Dire Wolf, and Power of the Triune. This build can also be referred to as 33211, so if someone says that, this is what it means. As for the skill points, you put points into Iron Paw, Claw, and Rampage, in that order. Now onto the equipment. If you plan on playing the Iron Claw spec, you 100% need to go with the Long Soul, as it will sync with your Wolf form. As for your bracelet, you want to use Phoenix. Or if you can skip Phoenix and get the latest bracelet, then Battalion is your best in slot. Next is your Soul Badge. You want to fuse Enforcer with Vantage to get Exemplar. If you cannot fuse due to a lack of materials or for whatever reason, and you can only use a purple tier soul badge, then I believe Vantage is the recommended badge until you can fuse. Mystic badge is up next. So Harmonic would be your first step. Once you can get your hands on Legendary tier, then Oscillation is the next one. The best in slot is the Escalation Badge, and that's from Scarlet Conservatory, aka ET. Alright, so now I'll explain how you can exchange your current gear for the stuff to best suit Iron Claw. To exchange for the Exemplar Soul Badge, you cannot do it if you have an Ancestral Badge, and that's really weird, but that's how they did it. So in the event, you have the Wildborn Legendary Badge. Or the Warsong Legendary Badge. Then you can straight up exchange it for Exemplar with a KFM Exemplar Compass. And then that is purchased from the first exchange tab in Dragon Express. It costs 10 gold and 1 Naryu Silver. As for the other equipment, you want to head over to the Dragon Trade Union NPC. At the Divine or Tiger Bracelet tier, stage 10 or Awakened, you can exchange Phoenix with a Iron Claw. And that Iron Claw is bought from the same tab in Dragon Express, and it costs 5 Naryu Tal. At the Starbreaker or Divinity tier, you can exchange it into Battalion, and it will require an unrefined Battalion bracelet. And that's bought from the Merchant in Solak for 5 Tranquility Emblems. Finally, for your Mystic Badge, just talk to the NPC right here, and you can straight up exchange your VT badge for oscillation or if you already have the ET grade you can exchange it for escalation so both VT and ET can be straight up exchanged through the NPC alright so that's the equipment and talents you need to ensure optimum iron claw spec and where and how to exchange your gear I will include all the information down below for your reference the ideal rotation for the normal Titan and Wolf stance is a work in progress and I'll try to get that out as soon as possible. As always, my social links will be in the video description. Be sure to like and subscribe. Thanks for watching. Peace out.